It's typically a nice place for a walk in the park. It was anything but that Sunday night for a group of friends. I mean, he's my brother. He will always be my brother. Just this weekend, they heard what they didn't want to be true, that a burning car found one week ago had their friend Trevor Dilger inside. Everybody just felt there was a sense of hope that it wasn't going to be him. That he was just going to, you know, comment on something on Facebook like, y'all are crazy. Yeah, I'm here. This is who he was. Sunday friends lit candles and stood together to remember their buddy. It was an emotional night, but they couldn't help but crack a smile talking about the guy they knew as Dilly. Since middle school, I know we were always good buddies, and then I joined the military about four years before he did, and then he kept talking to me about it and asked me about it, and I, I finally convinced him to do it. And he loved it when he was in. He absolutely loved the military. The idea for tonight's vigil started out on a Facebook post. It got a ton of shares, and friends tell us they're so excited to see this many people come out to support their friends. So you know, everybody here, you know, played an influence in Trevor's life, whether it was outside of school or, you know, in school. This to me is everything. This is what I think that we need more of. People coming together and speaking to one another and just being there for one another. Friends say there's not much they can do going forward. They're just holding on to the good times. I love you, Billy, and uh, I'll see him another, another time one day. In Lexington, Caitlin Setner, WKYT.